What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. This is a Third Person Podcast. I'm Chris. That's Mike. What's up? We are Westworld. Oh, you like that? We are Westworld. <laughs> Episode 9. Vanishing Point. One go- more to go. Mikey. Yes, one more to go. Listen, we've got a lot to unpack. This yeah. this episode, before we jump into it, this last week's episode was bar none one of the best. This episode absolutely rivals that. I actually think they're on par with each other, I th- yeah. but in different ways. Dude, he killed his daughter. <laughs> Very what? sad very sad because with the with the whole backstory that we got of of his his wife and and how she committed suicide and we saw such a bond somewhat of a bond between emily and and william right. so it was it was sad to see but you can it gives you a glimpse of how how crazed and and how william's mind just isn't right and how he just barked at her and yelled at her and thinks he you know it's forward playing this game using his daughter He's 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 essentially flipped his lid and yeah. speaking of lid real quick yes. dude we got we got so much information this time around like I cannot every at every every other minute I'm going oh oh they they've been pouring it on this whole season dude they've been giving I mean, us so much like just fantastic it's been like, great. I'm gonna, man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fan out, and it's like the writing on this show. These people know what the f they're doing. They know yeah. what they are doing, and they're doing it so right. The hats, Mike. The hats, which remember they showcase those hats, man. Remember? Yeah. yeah. They they made you choose, but the hats are what's taking the data. Like that is ingenious. That is yeah. insane. I think he said it just takes everything because she she questions him about the project, Emily. Yeah. And he's giving her all this information. She's like, "Holy shit!" How did you know? He's like, "We just, we just took everything. Took everything. And yeah. we parsed it later, but like." And she takes the hat off quick. Yeah, you know, and she kind of apprehensively put puts it back on. So, but uh, Ford yeah. gives him his own profile, and so the way I'm t- dude, this this episode felt like two or three episodes together. I don't know if you felt like that. But to me, it felt like it was like it was. It felt like it was really long. Yeah. And then, but because we got so much, immer- so it cut it cut up, right? You you yeah. saw him at this at this little event. His wife getting drunk. Take the wife home. But then they seem to talking to Ford. Then he takes the wife home, and they see the fight, and he puts the thing in the book, and then it goes back, and it ex- he explains to her. We see exactly why she died because him. I'm like I I couldn't take it. I couldn't take it. Like that story alone. The whole Williams story this season has been phenomenal. Just mm-hmm. so sad. Even from beginning, even when we saw that William was when William was connecting with James Delos and those scenes and everything like that. Oh, it's just man. dude, like I said a million times, this season has given us so much. How about the fact that with the profile card, mm-hmm. um, when no, William's we... wife puts it on there, she she oh, takes out God. the jewelry box that Emily speaks about that she threw out. She thought she she thought she lost it, and the yeah. mom took it back. And right. the mom ended up taking it. So I was like, very sweet that you know the mother saved it and never told right. Emily that she had it. Um, dude, even the even the few minutes of Ford and William together was was great because we never seen them together. He did not like. Yeah, and he did not. Oh no, we we seen him a couple times here and there. Ford visited him in the. Right? Season one, Ford visited him in the bar, like in a bar. Oh, that's right. At one that's point. Right. That's um, right. But, I guess but, it's because it's been so long. But. Yeah, but let's – and it's been great having Anthony Hopkins back. But before yeah. we move further with that, I just want to talk about when she looks at the card on the data pad, that dude – first of all, it says subject 002, which means that's the second uh, group of data. It's the second subject that they've got data from was him. Who was the first? Was it was it Logan? Was it James Delos himself? Because J- don't forget, I I am assuming it's James Delos because that was what we see him at trying to create a host out of James Delos, right? Yeah. To live forever. I think it's James Delos. Number one, number two, he's like point zero zero seven two percent. It's rare. It's red. He's a he's a flipping psycho. They and it says it right there. He's delusional. Yeah. He's, he's got um all these dude he's just he's 
and she sees this and she flips out. Couple that with the fact that he's bonded and as against the wife with the daughter, she felt it was, just it was dark. very much two against one. Yeah, and she felt completely alone. And his speech to her, I'm sorry, you're right, you're absolutely you got my number. I'm a I'm a monster. I've got this darkness and this is not my world. And when he said those words like this, I don't belong, you know, whatever he said, I was like floored. I mean, I, I kind of knew it was coming, but I was like, yeah. damn it. Like, just think of the ramifications of that, bro. Like, he just doesn't belong in this world, like, where he has flesh and blood, you know? And he just wants to be... But that's, you know, at that point, he was just... I think he was true to himself for, for once in his whole life. He became true to himself. And yeah. she knew that. He's like, I don't belong to you. Like, insane. He was just so engulfed in it. It's so yeah. sad, and it's just, but it's it's riveting, man. Riveting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. great, great, great portion. Anything else with him? He killed. Uh, I just, I can't believe he killed her. I don't think she was a host, man. I don't think. She I don't was think a she host. was a host. No, I don't think she was a host so, either. Because he kind of admits it. He kind of says the only okay. way you would know about my profile, whatever, is if and you had the card or hand, something. Man, and she had yeah. that in her hand. Nice try. And then, so yeah. then, okay, let's get into it. Is he a host or not a host? At first, I mean, we talked about this after talking with you a little bit about it. I'm kind of just thinking that he's maybe he's just so there's just so yep. so much going on. He's that he's, he he's himself lost don't know. He's lost if grip he's on a reality, host or not. Yep. We and, saw him in that scene after Emily and all this kind of stuff, and when he was holding the gun against his head. He goes down to the arm where that's where you link and up. And he just digs in and then up. it cuts. Yeah. So we don't know. I'm thinking. I don't think he is. I think I, I think I, he wants to be, Mike. I think he wants to be. That's the problem. I think he wants to be a host. Like, I think he sees himself maybe as a host. Like, he's just been living in this world for so long. You think he wants to be or he's just like we said that he's just so crazed that he himself he just doesn't I, know I, I the, think he does which like, I, world yeah i think that but i also think it, part of him wants to be that like a part of him wants to be part of that world in any way that he can yeah. i don't know either way yeah. we're gonna find out i hope pretty sure but pretty um, sure will, i'm sorry if you hear the dogs barking too eh? and they're just trying to say how much they love the episode right. <laughs> so all right so yeah william i mean Crazy stuff. Crazy. Did you think, let me ask you this before we go, before we move on. Did you think he was going to kill himself? Uh, I thought that was how, that's how it was going to end. I, you know what? I'm going to be honest with you, man. I was like, could they kill him right now? They killed the daughter. They killed this person. He did. I'm like, could they kill? I, 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 you know, for a second, I didn't know. For yeah. a second, I thought they, they may just do that. Yeah, could I think this he realized he made a mistake by... I think in that realization of, of Emily laying there, I think he definitely knew she was Emily. And I think that's what was going to make him pull the trigger. But the, it, it goes to show you that even though he's he, he killed his daughter and the rest of these Delos men... Essentially killed his wife and his daughter. And, true. He still wants to fulfill this... Yeah. He's like, well, wait, I got nothing else. I might as well, I think. Right? He's very, very selfish. Oh, very, absolutely. very selfish. Absolutely. Also, I just want to make a quick correction. Um, Mike and I realized that I think we were calling Emily Grace, and yeah, I think I it, might have even put <laughs> I might have even put some of the Instagram stuff as Grace or oh, something. Oh, maybe. So we apologize for that. Guys. Where'd we get um, that from? If you guys Gra remember, is where Grace his wife. We're on IMDb all the time. I don't know how we missed this, but uh, we can look at it. You can correct us. It's fine. I'm probably not going to look it up, but whatever. We apologize for that. Okay. I would love to, oh before all right I want to I want to go to the to this to the the center well, I'm calling it the center but I want to go to the to the main base yeah and I want to talk about Robert and Maeve but before that let's talk about Clementine because they they figured out the code and now they've weaponized Maeve's gift put it into Clementine so she they're gonna send her out the park to wipe out to to end this yeah to wipe out all the hosts she can just she's like um. She's like a virus almost. Whoever she gets well, she close to, right? She can, she can turn them on each other, and they'll just kill. They'll just wipe each other out. Which, of... which is Mike. Yeah, I believe. I had originally said that it was going to be Maeve that causes all those hosts to die mm. that we saw in the water. Yeah, it, I now it's got to be Clementine. So I was partially right because I figured it was Maeve's power that did it, and 
And I think that, and now that she, that she has Maeve's power and they've weaponized it, yes, that's yeah. what's going to happen. I'm telling well, you. the Mark thing is, words. if 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 Clementine is the one that, because I agree, we see all the bodies and we saw that in the beginning of the season, all this kind of stuff. But how does the water get there? How does where does this water come from? Who does that? Well, we have yet to see. And does Clementine do this that? Is, this is or is, is that it part of Maeve? Is that or is it part of Dolores's plan? We don't know yet, but we'll get. Is to it the Delos that floods it? before they, you know i mean it's to end it yeah maybe yeah. maybe yeah. i don't know but anyway so that's going to be interesting that was a yeah. really cool scene ford so i i assume that ford left the system because elsie says to bernard the system cleared itself up that virus is no longer here or that code is gone or whatever mm -hmm. i thought he injected himself into bernard and that's what we've been seeing the past couple episodes is that he's in with bernard's psyche or brain or programming whatever but then we get a really amazing scene with robert and mave and we find out and and man it was very touching man because it was like i want he's like i wanted you to leave again i said it last week but ford wanted to turn this park inside out man Mm -hmm. he just he just wanted his creations to live he said i wanted a different life for you i wanted you to get out and go be in the real world. He wanted this for her. He's like, you, you, hold on. I got the quote. He says, um, you know, uh, dang it. Hold on. Oh, uh, she was his favorite. That's yeah. what he says. Out and of I'm all the hosts that I created, you're my favorite. And yeah. I'm sitting here going, wait, but how the hell? So I guess he's out. He's still in the system and can still talk to her. I he guess can probably jump into whomever he wants. Well, the guy's well, smart he enough did, to remember. Yeah. So he can, ultimately pro you know generate himself into any host psyche in into anyone i'm yeah. sure you know any of these any of the hosts or was... even maybe even dolores you know i yeah well oh maybe that's how things go down i don't know but i will say this there was a point i didn't write it down i was so enthralled i forgot to write it down but there was a point where he says a speech to mave and then he's and it stops and i was like that's awesome because i thought that was the ending point then he kind of reiterates it was like an alternate take almost that they just decided to put in. And I'm like, it was a little jarring because I'm like, well, you just had this amazing scene and he ended at this one point. I don't remember the words, sorry. But he ended at this one point. He ended a sentence and it was like, that would have been the perfect end. Cut, go somewhere else. Yet, it cut to a wider angle and just kept, and he just kept like reiterating. And I'm yeah. like, that, did, did you realize that? Did you notice that? Um, I, I mean, was I'm, like, no. I was like, no. wait, that's weird. Anyway, that was just something I noticed. But um, so Ford, oh my god, dude, Ford and Bernard. <laughs> I can't get you out of my head, you know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, do you think he deleted him? Seems that way, um, but it wouldn't. It wouldn't. Um, it wouldn't make me think. Uh, you know, there's a possibility that a Ford pot can pop in. Just like I said, uh, if he has the option to, to jump into host by host, maybe he can, uh, there's, there's nothing that Ford would do that. I don't necessarily think is, that, is that, possible. Right. That you'd think would be um, out of character for his, his, old, his, could his he have digital self? He tells, he tells Bernard, listen, he's like, if you, um, I forget exactly what the quote is, but pretty much like, we're so good you, with that, aren't we? If you get rid of me, um, you're doing, you know, you're, you're doing this on your own. You're making a mistake. You can't trust her and this and that. And all this kind yeah, of, he sa LP she and says, he says, she's going to turn on you to, to Bernard. Yeah. Bernard says, I'm not going to hurt her. You're not going to make me hurt her. He's like, you didn't hurt her last time. Mm -hmm. And he's like, uh, and then I loved it because later she's like, are you going to hurt me? Yeah. I just, I just, I love it. I love it. I love well, he, he he most likely he saved her life. This exactly. Time. He's like, I know you don't believe this now, but I, you know, I'm you helping know? you. I really like Elsie this season. I'm glad they brought her back. I really like she's you know what she's got, Mike? You know what she's got? She's got Moxie. She does. She's got Moxie. She's the one that jumps down. She's the one that's thinking. Yeah, and she's got Hutzpa. Hutzpa. Yeah, Can getting the <laughs> some Hutzpa. She's Hutzpa the one that hops out Moxie. of the the how about how badass are those like Jeep dune buggy things? Oh my god, that white one was place, sick, dude. That's the best looking uh, one. Yeah, but she has I'm she has with this, P90s, man. I just yeah. love the P90s. Yeah. And she's out there. Uh, Elsie's out there collecting bullets. And she's like, whatnot. this is. She's like, this is bull. There's nothing. Yeah. 
Yeah. I don't know, man. That was sick. Uh, so where's he going? He's gonna. He's he going to the forge? Is that where he's going? That's where everybody's going. He They're says all headed to the forge. Yeah, yeah, he says we have to get there before the hosts do because yeah, yeah, no, yeah. the hosts can't leave with the information that's there. Well, we saw it. We saw the server farm, dude. We saw yeah. it in the coming attractions. We saw that's the where servers. everybody's yeah. going. So now that server farm is that all those cards? Uh, well, I think the card is basically like that USB thing, but basically, yes, right? that's where all that is. That data, like a library of that's where these? right. That is where all yeah. that data is, right? Um, yeah. I don't know, man. I am I, I, again just scene after scene, right? We're just one after the other. I was just floored. Every scene was amazing, mm -hmm. um, which leads us to the last scene. Yes. Um, well, before we get to the last scene, let's let's talk about real quick how they wipe out the ghost nation. Or no, they wipe out the. Uh, what do they call them? Uh, the the se se separate what do they call the scavengers? No, what were they called? We said it the from or last week. They? The Ghost Nation. Those those that group. Oh um. Oh shit. Ska oh, such so an S. Sorry guys. You we should. <laughs> you're screaming it out right now. I should have wrote shit. it down. Anyway, I have it in my notes over there. So though I want to say scavengers, but it's not scavengers. Um, no, it's not. That well, the, group, the ghost nation yeah but that's that splinter nation. cell of the ghost yeah. nation and so they wiped them out their whole crew and she's like it's just you and me now teddy and teddy sees the sec that guy and he lets well, she go. says wipe out she says wipe out the rest of them look for like look for stragglers right and then he sees that the head of you know well not the head the that uh, the second in command kind of guy right um i think yeah, I, I, oh, I just messed my camera up. Obviously, what happens is he, he's, he, you know, he's like, so that's I, when he makes his decision, man. Yeah, it's driving me nuts now that I can't remember the friggin' thing that you said. I, uh, yeah, you'll figure what it they out. Call it. <laughs> but, dude, I'm like, I want to so, dive into my notes. So, he, so, so, yeah, so I, I knew it right there. I was like, oh, no, this isn't good. Yeah. Like, Teddy's, Teddy's already. Here's the beauty of it, man. Mm hmm. And and I don't know what you want to call it, but because Teddy remembers everything, Teddy liked who he was. Yes, he got killed all the time, and yes, he was the underdog, but you want to know something? He had love for her, and he explains to her, he says, I loved you from the very first time I saw you, which yeah. was incredible scene. Mm -hmm. He wakes up, you know, self-activate, and he wakes up, and he looks yeah. over, and he sees Dolores, like in uh, a shutdown Dolores, and he falls in love. Like, I feel this is that played, was great. played beautifully by James Marsden. I love this guy, man. This guy's amazing. Yeah. Everybody in this show does an amazing job. But I don't know, man. It's so it's so damn poetic that he still, out of all the tampering that she did to him and made him stronger and whatever she said, he still ended up being Teddy. And and I honestly, completely forgetting that he ends up in that pile of bodies thought he was going to kill her and this is the second time in the episode that i was like oh my god could this happen first i thought it was going to be william oh my god is william going to off himself then i was like oh my god is he going to kill dolores because i was thinking yeah. if because think about it if he say he killed dolores but then he killed himself because we didn't know where dolores was after the fact remember i almost, I almost wanted him to kill dolores yes in a way, yes right? i i was like yes I mean, I wasn't like, do it, but I was like, yeah. if he did, yeah. that would be, because that's what happened. So so in, in my head, what happened was, I'm like, holy shit, he's going to kill her. Holy shit, he's going to kill her. And he yeah. takes the gun out, and she doesn't do anything. Then I'm thinking, hold on, Dolores, you're not you're not fast enough for that. Because remember, he's super fast now. Yeah, he's like quick draw, yeah. You're not, he's quick draw, McGraw. You're not getting that shot off, Dolores. I'm like, you're toast. But yep. then I realized, that he's going to do it to himself. And then I was like, Oh my God, wait, he's going to kill her then himself. But then he only offed himself. And I'm like, <laughs> and she, and you mentioned it or you mentioned it off camera, but her reaction was, was so good. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Is, that, is that you and my brother? I don't remember. Well, I think your brother, but I was talking about <laughs> like, how, I was talking about how his, his quote was, you know, just the, just the narrative between each of them. Um, how he says, you turned me into a monster and how, where you're just making us, or you're making myself feel just as bad as the people that you want me to kill. And yeah, all this, yeah. you know, so it, um, Hey, I mean, it was, it was a badass. Um, it was a badass. I scene. can't believe it, but I mean, they're not really, he's not really dead. 
Yeah. Right? But well, for all intents and purposes, and Mikey, that is the beauty of this show. Mm-hmm. Seventy five percent of these, eighty percent of these characters are not human, yeah. yet they're the most human in the show. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. like you feel, for, yeah. I'm telling you, man, this show, this show is fin- is phenomenal. Um, yeah. Let me just, I don't know, man. Let me just check my notes, see if I got anything else. Um, I don't know, man. Oh, the music, dude. The music for that scene, that uh-huh. that mute, that that sound, that music, what playing the whole time. He's saying this to her, and then he kills himself, and she's like, ah, oh, I, I can't, I can't say anything more good yeah. about this. I can't even put, put proper sentences <laughs> together, man. And the show, the show knows how I to do it. it. I love it. They, you know, and to, know all the, to and all, and to everyone out there who's saying, oh, this isn't as good as the first one. You're right. It's not. It's better. It's yeah. phenomenal. This is writing. This is a show. Sorry, Walking Dead. You're never going to get this good. <laughs> You know what I mean? It's much. Listen, I hate to compare because the show is so much different. The budget's so much, so much higher on the HBO series compared to the the AMC stuff. It's like comparing. But you, you know, know, budget Game aside, Mikey, or, the writing it's is still so do the good. acting is is phenomenal in this. It's the writing. It's, you it's, can have like a a Chata, right? Who was who was last Achetta? week? Chata, yeah. Achetta. Achetta. Look yeah. look at what a job he's done. Oh you know, God. and he and he's go back and watch some, that again, dude. Yeah, such he's a good just episode. some secondary kind of character there, not one of these main guys. It's just that's what makes these series. That's what makes Game of Thrones such a great series, and that's what makes Westworld such a great series. And and I don't like to compare them to the AMC stuff because I just think that this it's so, apples and oranges. Yeah, yeah, yeah the acting is so much. Besides the writing, the acting is although, phenomenal. Although I will the say though, we are this positive. In all the ca- in all the actors, right? In this, it's, they're, they're it's, not, They are absolutely. And I'm phenomenal. not taking anything away from the Badlands, from Fear, from Walking Dead, because we have some fantastic actors on that show. But as a as a whole, the HBO stuff beats it. Out it's of a, the yeah, it, 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 from it's the it, smallest it's a, to the yeah. grandest. It's character. in a different league. It's in a different league. Yeah. And you know, obviously, the Badlands. We we also we also you know blow blow the horns for the for badlands because badlands us right now is it's comparable to westworld to me but obviously they're two different things you have the tv much much different we love both that's why we're doing these two shows right now (laughs) and only these shows because you know and i know i know fear is supposed to be like pretty good this season and i'm gonna and i am gonna watch it and we may end up doing like a recap thing for it but i was just kind of over it i couldn't i couldn't i couldn't I, yeah. I I was so tired of being negative. Doesn't it feel so good to be just positive about a show now? Between yeah, Badlands and Westworld, I'm having I'm having a blast doing our show, and and I think yeah. that's what really that's that to me that's all that really matters. I just no, I, I will agree. say I will say I just wish more of you people were watching these these episodes for Westworld, and I get it. It's probably the fact that Westworld is a premium paid ki- channel, and I get that, but. <laughs> It's you know still what? this show is so good. Let me let me let me let me speak about that. Remember, from the first season, we had a bit we had like a year and change yeah, but, a, before big, the season. Yeah. I remember um by this by the time season one ended, they weren't even sure if they gonna they were gonna pick it up. The oh my god, no season dude, this, two. Remember this season, man? Whoa. I know, I think it's much different. I think there was I can see how you can lose a bit of viewers in season one because there was just so much stuff going on. And, and it was it different was done and people were scared different. of different stuff, right? That That's true. And it also, there was multiple timelines. It was very confusing. We didn't know until the end of season one w- which came first and all this and all this kind of stuff and who was right. who and, and all this. So I, I, I can see, um, and I think HBO saw that. And I think that's why we're getting... Bang, bang, bang! It's 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 a lot less confusing. As so you're far as yeah the okay. Timeline. So you're we saying know, yeah okay. Uh, they they they, they kind made of it just, more concise. Um, they tweaked they, it. Yeah, they bit. gave they gave us what I think it's great. I don't think they're giving us too much. I think they still have the mysteries, mm-hmm. and then that's what mm-hmm. you got to do. Look, you only have ten yeah. episodes, man. You got to make them count. You got to no, make them. They're making them count. them count, all right. They're making them count anyway. You know, all right. Tenfold, but. Look, so uh, let's end this video here. We've gone a little yeah. bit longer than we usually do on these Westworld videos. But again, I am absolutely psyched and sad at the same time for the finale next week. Yeah. Um, you know, so I don't know. You know, thank you. You know, thank you everyone for watching. 
Uh, of course, get those comments below, of course, and uh, you know, tell some friends. You know, we're we're not uh, we're not hitting the target as much as as some of the other shows that we do. We want you guys to really enjoy the show. So if you if you enjoy Westworld, tell a friend, check us out. Let them just you know. Re- just think along with us and check out the discussions and let us know what you think. Of course, at third person pod on YouTube in the comments section, check us out at third person pod on Facebook and on Instagram and have a listen to us or have a, a watch, a look, see on iTunes as well. Yep. That's going to do it for us this time on third person. Thank you so much guys. We love you. We'll see you on the next Westworld video. Peace.